Hello dear friends, this is Dr. Muhammad Aminul Islam. Welcome to my channel. In my previous video, I explained how to interpret pseudo second order kinetic model. This video has been very popular. Therefore, in this video, I would like to explain how to interpret pseudo first order reaction. This video is very important, so please do not skip. Well, let us consider assumption. Pseudo first order model is based on the assumption that the rate of change of solute uptake with time is directly proportional to the difference in saturation concentration and the amount of solid uptake with time. And it is applicable over the initial stage of an adsorption process. In the pseudo first order model, if one of the two reactants is in greater excess, its relative concentration will remain unchanged. Its concentration can be absorbed at the expressed rate, rate resulting in the pseudo first order reaction rate constant. This occurs because the rate of reaction is dependent on the same concentration of only one of the two reactants. In this process, the rate limiting step mechanism involves a diffusion process and the reaction rate does not depend on the concentration of both reactants but only on concentration of the adsorbate for a single adsorbate system. And the kinetic model is considered to be controlled by physisorption. Now the equation for CD first order equation can be written as this. The upper one is the nonlinear form and the lower one is the linear form. And in my previous videos, I have showed how to fit these equations using Origin Pro, MS Excel, and MS Excel Solver. Now comes to interpretation. If an adsorption process follows true first order kinetics, then the intercept of log QE minus QT versus T plot would be equal to the log of experimentally determined QE or adjusted feet of the experimental value R square. That means if the adsorption process follows C2 first order reaction then R square value will be greater than C2 second order reaction. However, it should be remembered that for slow adsorption process true equilibrium can be difficult, difficultly reached making it very difficult to measure QE accurately. However, it is commonly observed that kinetics follow this uh, pseudo first order rate equation when adsorption occurs through diffusion through the interface. So this is the reference from where most of the informations have been collected. In my next video, I will explain other interpretation of kinetic models thanks for watching please do visit aminul cam innovation and don't forget to subscribe this channel for new videos